Hey guys, it's Kiki, and today I'm going to be showing you guys 11 ways to study for maths and how to ace maths. This video was suggested by... Thank you so so much, and if you guys have any suggestions for future videos, please let me know. Anyways, without further ado, let's get on with the video. The first hack is to have a separate notebook to write out questions you got wrong and rewrite the answer slash solution. I find that this is super useful when going back and studying or revising. Basically, if you make any mistakes, write out the question and write how you got it wrong and also how to figure out the correct answer. The second hack is to have a notebook to write down any questions you have for the teacher. This is extremely useful when it comes to exam seasons because when you are studying or revising for an exam, I can guarantee that you will have at least one question for the teacher. So when you write down questions that you have, the next time you have a lesson with them, ask them. The third hack is to make sure your formulas stand out in your notes. When you are making your notes, make sure to always make formulas or important definitions stand out by either highlighting it or writing it on a sticky note. I find that this is super helpful when revising it because you know exactly where it is and you won't have to look for it. The fourth hack is to write down everything the teacher writes slash talks about during class. I know that this sounds really obvious, but a lot of people actually don't do this. So everything and anything the teacher says, always try to write it down. The fifth hack is to read through your notes before you go to bed. This is so, so, so useful. But basically what you do is before sleeping, read through the notes you took. This increases your memory as you are repeating what you learnt and emphasizing all the information. The sixth hack is to try to understand formulas instead of just knowing them. So this is especially useful if the formulas you are learning are complicated. So for example, if we take an easy formula like the area of a triangle, which is the width times the height divided by two. This can be easily understood by thinking that the area of a triangle is half of the rectangle. The seventh hack is to use spaced repetition. This is one of my all-time favorite methods if I am trying to remember a definition or formula. Basically, I like to use this app called Repetitions, which has the spaced repetition method in it. All you have to do is just check in with these spaced out times and read through or test the concept. The eighth hack is to practice, practice and practice. Practicing is one of the best methods when it comes to maths as doing it over and over again will ensure you know how to solve the problems. If there are practice questions, try to do as many as you can before the exam. The ninth hack is to practice only the harder problems or problems you don't understand if you don't have time. So this ties in with the previous one, but if you don't have that much time until your exam, try practicing only or mostly just the harder problems or problems you struggle with. The tenth hack is to do your homework immediately after you get it. This is actually so useful as it makes sure that you know the concept when you are doing the homework immediately as you already learnt it and doing it straight after will ensure you know how to do it properly and also keeps you organised. The eleventh hack is to use online resources. When you really don't understand a concept Use online resources such as Khan Academy or YouTube as they are extremely useful. I love using Khan Academy as it is so much easier to understand. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know down below if you guys are subscribed or not because I'm curious. Also let me know if you guys want a video on how I take math notes. As always, make sure to subscribe 
Give this video a thumbs up and comment down below what video you would like me to do next. Bye guys, happy studying!